fourth. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I thought I was in 3P7 shape, which I, I am, which is nice to know, but I honestly did not think that was not gonna make the team. <laughs> so it just shows you where uh, American milers are at right now, which is so impressive. And obviously we're sending a really strong team to Paris, so I couldn't be more happy for them. But yeah, for myself, that really hurts. Like, um, I I did everything in my power to make the team put myself in position. Like, I don't know, what more you can do. You looked like you were in great position. Yeah, I was in second the whole time. I was like, you know, going into this race, wanting to win. I was gonna go for first and hoping that if I didn't get first, I'd at least get third. And yeah, fourth is unfortunately not uh, not new to me. I've been fourth a lot and it hurts every time. So There's a chance yeah. Ellie won't go, right? In the 15? I think she's gonna scratch the 5K is what it sounded like oh. and run the 15, which I mean, she should. Like, yeah. To, after two 5k rounds to come back and run 355, like, you gotta go into the team team, yeah. so, yeah. Sinclair, was there anything that surprised you about the race at all? Like I know you said you weren't just no. for yes. seven wins. No, that race was exactly how I thought it was gonna play out. I knew Ellie was gonna go out hard. I think we went through in 61. Which, you know, maybe thinking back on it now was probably a little too fast for me, but when you're in a championship race, time's not a matter. Um, you're just trying to place high, and so I didn't care if we went through in two flat or if we went through in 212, I was gonna be right on her, and yeah, it's just the last 100 really started to creep up on me, and just had honestly nothing left. There's still yeah. so much to be proud of, like you said, 357, yeah. a massive lifetime best. Yeah, this There's is a season ahead if you still want to race. For sure, I mean, this has been, I think, like the hardest year of my life. <laughs> um, I had a lot of, a lot of setbacks this year, and to get here and run what I did, I'm, I'm like really proud, but yeah, I want I wanted to go to Paris. I wanted, like, really wanted to go to Paris, so yeah. Is it, when you look into your feelings, is it like anger that you were capable? Is it more like disappointment that you um, offered your best and it wasn't enough? I honestly I mean, don't really know what I'm feeling right now besides, yeah, sadness. Um, I mean, you know, all of us, I feel like this has been kind of the moral this year is a lot of athletes have gone through injury and I feel like I handled that as well as I could. I really feel like I put myself in the best possible situation coming in. And the nature of the matter is three women were better than me today. And I mean, yeah, that's what happened. So, yeah. What was the injury you were dealing with? Um, I had a femoral neck or a femoral shaft chest reaction. I mean, I've had so many fucking bone injuries. <laughs> I just need to stay healthy, so, um, yeah, like you said, um, I did the best I could with circumstances.